just because it's a non-traditional route. Next we have Cadence Asad. Doesn't make it the wrong route. I've been waiting for this day my whole life. This walk across this stage isn't the typical strut into greatness, but it's the journey these students embarked on to get where they needed to be. All thanks to this initiative that now leaves 18 grads walking towards their future. This program is to help students who are behind on credits or have kids or who just want to get their diploma. They push you and they motivate you every day. Acceleration Academies have been helping students in Nectar County get another chance of success for the past three years. Our contract actually is a partnership where we help students that could possibly be potential dropouts or, and we help them recover some of their dropouts. Think of it as this program is providing the same resources that traditional students already have, except life happens. That's when this program comes in. All these graduates are in this program for different reasons, whatever that reason may be. All those roads led them here, right on this stage, with a cap and gown, just like any other graduate. And they got there because of a flexible and personalized learning style with more focus from their teachers. For them, that's the recipe for success. And they interact with the kids, but the rapport and the relationship that we build with them is, is different. And I think you'll hear that from them. We stay on them, we call them, we ride them, we do home visits. When the days when I had work and stuff, she'd always make sure that I was always on top of my work. I don't know, I can't be around big groups. And here they gave me the option to do home and come here on campus and spend time with like my grandmother. And sometimes all it takes is a different approach to really show greatness. A lot of times we have students here who have not felt smart, who uh, no one's ever told them that they were smart. Or one kid told me, no one's told me since elementary school, miss. And I said, but you are. Look at what you're doing and how quickly you're doing it and how well you're doing it. Look at your grades. It means a lot to me because it feels like I got like another chance. I'm proud of myself for actually doing it and I'll give you enough. Most people would be like, oh, I already have a job, so let me just drop out. There's no point in graduating. I'm good, not even going to lie. Um, I failed. I would have just quit right then and there whenever I failed. I wouldn't have made it this far, so just keep going. These seniors turned grads now plan on doing all sorts of things with their new diplomas, including trying to become, well, whatever they want. Cardiovascular technician. And become a truck driver. A nail tech. Get my welding career started. Each grad has a story to tell. And by flipping their tassels, they'll soon flip the page to their new beginnings, where they can always this is just one of the proudest days of my life, and I'll never forget it. Rise to the top. In Odessa, I'm Marcus Rising, News West 9.